Scientists have warned today that the world will almost certainly experience its hottest year on record within the coming five years, and a key temperature threshold is likely to be breached for the first time, which is a rise in global temperature by 1.5 degrees Celsius above pre-industrial levels. Our climate editor, Justin Rowlatt, has more details. Remember last summer? Temperatures in England breached 40 degrees Celsius for the first time, driving wildfires and helping make 2022 the hottest year ever recorded in the UK. And we can expect even hotter weather worldwide in the coming years, according to the World Meteorological Organization, the UN's weather and climate body. Rising temperatures, thanks to global warming, are one reason. But we are also seeing a change in a crucial weather system in the Pacific Ocean called El Nino. For the last few years, winds blowing along the equator have been stronger than normal, pushing warmer water towards the coast of Asia and helping deep cold water well up on the coast of the Americas. This phase is known as La Nina and is associated with below average global temperatures. We're now moving into the El Nino phase, where winds are weaker, which mean warm water spreads across the Pacific. Now, that tends to increase global temperatures by about 0.2 degrees Celsius on average. Now, that does not sound much, but it makes it almost certain a 98% chance, according to the UN's weather experts, that one year in the next five will be the hottest ever recorded. And it gives us a two in three chance, 66%, that global temperatures will exceed the 1.5 degree Celsius global warming threshold between now and 2027. That's never happened before in terms of a, a yearly average global temperature. So we are heading into unprecedented territory to temperatures we simply haven't experienced before. And the impacts will be equally unprecedented. I'm frightened, I'm frightened, says this woman as she drives through floodwaters on an Italian motorway. Today's report comes as a number of people have been reported killed and several are missing after heavy rains caused extensive flooding in northern Italy. The Grand Prix circuit at Imola has flooded and this weekend's race has been cancelled. Our changing climate will make this kind of intense rainfall more common in future, say climate scientists. Justin Rowlatt, BBC News.